Good evening Philippines, this is Mike Padawa and we are back to our latest analysis for this Monday through Wednesday, August 8 to 10, 2022 and this is brought to you by Typhoon 2000. Let's begin with our update. Here's the latest graph set for today, Monday until tomorrow, Tuesday. Tropical uh, disturbance or LPA 97W is still here over the uh, South China Sea and it's uh, moving uh, closer to the uh, east coast of Vietnam. And it's currently quasi stationary and it's now uh, showing uh, characteristics of a monsoon depression wherein the winds. The strong winds are located along its periphery, somewhere here, okay? So the, the winds near the center is very weak. That's why it's called as a monsoon depression, wherein the winds are along its periphery. And uh, along the peripheral uh, section of this uh, monsoon depression, we have the southwest monsoon affecting Mimaropa. Sulu Archipelago, Kalayan Island Group, and the western sections of uh, Central and Northern Luzon. And expect some on and off uh, rainfall with some uh, thunderstorms. And the rest of Luzon will also be affected by its monsoon trough all the way up to Bicol region. And uh, various sections of Mindanao will also have some cloudy skies with uh, rain showers and thunderstorms, especially along the eastern uh, sections and southern coastline because of the uh, uh, development of a new low pressure system. But this is a weak one or shallow and it's located over the South Philippine Sea. Based on the computer models, this uh, low pressure system will uh, not intensify and is expected to track more towards the north and uh, dissipate okay so uh, don't forget to bring your umbrellas rain gear because there are still some thunderstorms especially in the afternoon or evening and if we uh, take a look at the latest uh, fast animation from uh, University of Wisconsin tropical cyclone page the tropical uh, uh, low is still here. Japan Meteorological Agency already upgraded it into a tropical depression and uh, it's uh, still also uh, stationary over the South China Sea with the winds of the uh, southwest monsoon and uh, rain bands affecting the western sections of Central Luzon, particularly Sambales. Here's the zoom in satellite animation as you can see. This is the uh, satellite uh, beginning at 4 p.m. up to this uh, uh, evening at around 9 p.m. There are still some occasional monsoon rains affecting the western sections of central and northern Luzon, including Mimaropa, while Bicol region showed some improvement with the weather during the past uh, daytime, but uh, expect also some afternoon or evening rain showers and thunderstorms while over Mindanao, we have the trough of the weak uh, low pressure or shallow LPA to the east of the island. And if we take a look at the uh, uh, forecast from the Japan Meteorological Agency, so this is the track of the JMA. It is expected to move north-northeast at first and move northward and eventually west-northwest-to-west. And uh, it is expected to make landfall based on their forecast between Hainan and Leju Peninsula that will be in the afternoon of August 10. Okay, that will be on Wednesday. And if we uh, take a look at the rain and the wind forecast, as of now we have the uh, peripheral winds brought about by this monsoon depression which is 97W and the southwest monsoon combined effects on Tuesday afternoon the uh, effects of the southwest monsoon will, re will remain along the uh, western seaboards of Luzon including Mimaropa and uh, Metro Manila will also be experiencing some rains and thunderstorms in the afternoon or evening also big region Visayas and on Wednesday afternoon the uh, LPA already a tropical depression or a tropical storm making landfall over leisure or northern Hainan while the southwest monsoon will start to weaken. However, thunderstorm activity will still prevail across, uh, across Mimarapa 
Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. So, it's nationwide. Okay? Especially in the afternoon or evening. And on Thursday afternoon, again, thunderstorms will persist in various sections of the country with the flow of the uh, southwesterly surface wind flow. It's already a weak uh, habagat, but still, the monsoon winds will... Uh, be affecting the West Philippine Sea, including Panatag uh, Shoal and the Kalayan Island Group. So there you go. That's the latest for this uh, Monday evening. And we will return on Wednesday to give you more updates on the weather. This is Mike Paddy reporting. Stay safe always. Be hashtag weatherwiser. Good evening to all and thank you so much for watching our channel. <music>